Hi everyone, it's Kerry here and I am going to make a video today. It's a video that is going to be good, I'm assuming. When you try your best but you don't succeed. So I'm wearing my friend's pyjamas. Well, not my friend's pyjamas, my pyjamas from the TV show Friends. I've only done nail polish on one hand. So basically I'm a hot mess but let's roll with it. Today I'm going to be talking about 2018. Now, 2018 was a really good year for me, which is a bit strange because I know a lot of people are talking about how they would be glad to see the back of it. Um, it's very different for me because basically 2017 was an absolutely horrendous year for me so it really could only go up and I'm hoping 2019 is just as good. But it's kind of bittersweet because obviously I lost my dad in 2017 and I really wish that he was here in 2018 to kind of see everything that's happened for me but obviously he's probably watching but um, yeah so I'm going to talk about everything good that's happened for me in 2018 because there's been a lot of good stuff. So the first thing in 2018 that happened was I got a new job. So I applied for this job in December 2017 and never in a million years did I think I would actually get it because I thought I was kind of punching above my weight a little bit but um, long story short I did get it and it's absolutely amazing. I love my job and it's just a dream. The second good thing that happened to me in 2018 was I started singing at my local open mic nights. Now this was a really big step for me because I've never really done that. <laughs> like for example, I used to be part of a show choir so I was always used to singing with backing tracks and stuff like that. And yeah, I posted covers on YouTube with instruments and stuff like that, but it was not the same as performing for a live crowd. So it was kind of magical the first time I did that and people have really responded well to it and now I'm a regular and I've made a whole bunch of new friends and we go down, um, so it's on the third on the second Friday of every month and I perform most months and every Thursday we have a jam session so I've made a whole bunch of new friends and it's absolutely incredible. The next good thing that happened for me in 2018 was I joined a band. So I'm then the lead singer of a band called The Revinals and it's super cool. We have a Facebook page which I'll link in the description and I posted a couple covers on here from the band so you can go check them out, I'll link them as well. So, um, that was a lot of fun. We do like a lot of classic stuff like Bruce Springsteen and um, Creedence Clearwater. So it's been a lot of fun because I've always wanted to be part of the band and now I'm doing it. Like I feel like this year I'm doing a lot more things that maybe in the, in the past I would have been too scared to do. The next good thing that happened in 2018 was I made a whole bunch of new friends. So with the new job and a new band and a new like just a whole new life, I started to you kind know, of be more confident in myself I feel and I guess other people like that so um because I was never popular in school, I never had that many friends and the friends that I did have just were like, I would call them fake friends, is that tea? <laughs> so it's good to have some real friends who are actually going to be there for me and I trust them and it's just it's amazing. The next thing is, I went on a holiday of a lifetime to Mexico. Mexico's gorgeous, it's so beautiful. We went zip lining, we went swimming in the, um, in the ocean and it was just incredible. The, at the hotel, monkeys were going, like just walking about like normal. Um, it was an eco resort, so like, the animals that were there were being like, um, cared for in order to put them back in the wild and the monkeys you would they would just come up to you and like, take bananas off you and it was absolutely amazing because I love animals so um, it was really really just a trip of a lifetime and I would go back in a heartbeat. So, this year I started dancing again. I took a year out of dance because I guess I just wasn't feeling it but I think I've rehabilitated and I've got my passion back because I absolutely am just having the best time and although I lost a lot of my flexibility I'm starting to get it back and um, I'm really enjoying it, like just doing it for fun. In 2018 I started making short films and 
it's like a whole new passion to filmmaking because and it's just been absolutely amazing to be able to kind of see it from the beginning because I write the scripts, I do the filming, I do the editing, I do absolutely everything, I do the directing and it's just been an amazing ride and I can't wait to do more. The next good thing that happened for me was I performed at my local Christmas market which is something I would have never have dreamed that I would be able to do um, and it was really just a great experience. It was wonderful, people stopped and watched. It was raining and it was really cold but it was worth it. 2018 I started going out with my boyfriend and yeah it's been good so um, I can't wait to see where 2019 takes us and yeah so basically to sum it all up I feel like 2018 changed me I'm much more confident I'm much more outgoing and I'm just ready for the next chapter I know it's cheesy well thank you so much for watching so many incredible things happened for me in 2018 and I really hope that 2019 lives up to my expectations now um so yeah I will see you next time and thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye.